Hi, I'm Elliot Tomaszewski of shortwayout.com. We wanted to formally invite you to our lead generation class that, that's helped us over at uh, shortwayout.com list more than a couple hundred properties over the last couple of years. We have several strategies that we're going to be going over in the class, but we just wanted to give you a small little uh, taste of what's to come. So we're going to just do a little role play for you. Um, so here we go. Ring, ring, ring. Hello? Hello, I was calling for Keith Howard, the owner of 1212 Primrose Lane. This is him. Hi, Keith. My name is Elliot Tomaszewski, and I work with shortwayout.com, and I was actually calling about your house on 1212 Primrose Lane to find out a little bit more of why it potentially did not sell. Well, uh, <clears throat> you know, it was listed by someone else, obviously, I'm sure you can see, but it, we just couldn't find the right buyer at the right time, and it looks like the house might be going to foreclosure. Okay, okay. Well, I see here in the MLS listing that, that you were listed uh, for six months, and it looks like, according to that particular information, that you only had one offer on that, on, on that property. Um, can you tell me briefly what, what happened? Well, all I know is, is they, you know, the real estate agent, they told me what the how my house is worth. So I, I gave them the trust to price the property, and they said that the offer that came in, you know, wasn't sufficient enough to get the deal done, and the buyers backed out, and now I'm back to square one again. It's, I'm very frustrated right yeah, now. Yeah, that's definitely an under understandable situation. Now, um, let me ask you a question here, Keith. If we were to bring a buyer that is a reasonable offer that's based on fair market value and it is something that was to happen sooner than later, would you still be willing to entertain a new offer and be able to do the short sale that you have been trying so hard for the last six months to avoid foreclosure? Well, yeah, of course I would like to, but you know, you're not the only person that's, that's tried to do this, so I'd have to talk to you a little bit more about what you do and then you know maybe it would be something that I can consider. Understandable. So let me ask you, what was it that helped you to choose the agent that you were working with before? Just somebody, uh, a friend that somebody knew. Okay, and uh, so do you know anything about their particular short sale experience? Uh, they told me they, they'd done a few short sales. Okay, great, great. Well, at uh, shortwayout.com, it's what we do all day, every day, and we actually specialize in working with short sales. We have a short sale loss mitigation team that um, helps us practice short sales in an extreme fashion. Like I said, it's an all day, every day experience. We have some uh, techniques and strategies that allow us to list properties um, in a little bit more of an aggressive manner than other agents. And what we do is we monitor proper, our properties on an everyday fashion that allows us to be able to get offers um, in, a, in a very quick and consistent manner. Okay. Okay, so if it's okay with you, what I would like to be able to do is set up an appointment with you to where I can go over these systems and strategies and show you how we close more deals than the average, than, certainly than the average agent. Yeah, I guess I could consider that. Okay, so would tomorrow at 3 o'clock be okay, or uh, the next day at uh, 11 a.m.? No, I don't want to. Uh, if we're going to do this, let's, let's get it done. Let's do it tomorrow. Okay, outstanding. I will be there, and I will be ready. Thank you for your time, and we appreciate you taking a minute to talk with us. Okay, thanks. Thank you. We'll see you in the class.